Um, okay, so you can come over here. Um, so for these, for the lateral skull, typically what we have already when you place your animal down, it's already uh, oblique lateral. If you want to oblique it more, you can just take a sponge, a wedge, and lift that up so that it's tipped even more. Um, some heads tip more than others. If you have the real big block heads, they don't tip as much. So that's nice and obliqued. Our center, typically we want it to be medial canthus, but again, remember, it depends on the length of the nose. So we want our center to be there. We might have to move our dog there. Okay. We want to go from the base of the skull to the tip of the nose. If we can, if you have this ability, turn that. Okay. Tip of the nose. Base of the skull. Put your right marker in and measure across the thickest part. Um, if you need to, if this, if your animal is not fully sedated, um, you can't do manual restraint on the head, even with gloves, because the entire head is in the primary beam. So, in order to combat that, if you need to, you can place tape across the head to help them if they're still able to lift their head. You can also use uh, a wooden spoon from farther away, either placed on the muzzle or placed on the, 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 the actual big part of the skull. Um, again, of course, remembering to be wearing lead if you're gonna be in the room. Okay, you can come.